Moin Leute, Herr wieder am Start. As you can see, I am indeed back, back again. And today we are gonna use this team. It is made from Phantom. It's by far not the, the finished version of the team. It's been a while since we talked, but uh, <laughs> basically, um, some things that he wanted to change were maybe like terror types. Something as well, something else he wanted to change. I forgot. Oh yeah, maybe Bronzong, for example. To give it like rain dance and stuff like this. I don't know. Oh, Battle Stadium Doubles is already online. Oh, amazing. Let's see if we can um, play some Battle Stadium Doubles. I haven't really played Pokemon, by the way. So, yeah, I had loads of stuff to do. Like partying and bitches. And <laughs> well, I'm joking, of course. Oh, yeah, one thing we talked about was changing this guy out for Amogus. Because then we will be obviously be able to um, clear smog, which is really good, for example, against the Dodonzo core, stuff like this. Either way, who cares? Let's just try out the team, you know. Um, wait, but stadium doubles. Wait, is this not? Oh, I didn't validate it. Oh, also, I have to call it Phantom, of course. Also, guys, if you want to send me teams. Go ahead, I'm always looking forward to this kind of stuff. And yeah, let's go. Oh wait. Yeah, better say him that was that's correct. Okay, so immediately we fight the hell team. Which kinda makes me wanna bring scissor. <clears throat> Actually don't know if I wanna set up trick room, because obviously they also got the option to trick room. However, Bronzong looks actually really good. What's the terror type right now on Bronzong? I think it's Steel. Still a bit sick, by the way. Yeah, I think I'm gonna change this to Fighting. Actually, let's make a copy of the team so we know what my version of the team is and what his version is. Um, let's stick to that. However, let's for now focus on the game. Um, I, I think I wanna lead, definitely lead Scizor. I think Scizor Bronzong and then Pelipper in the back. And this guy looks like he could be able to sweep maybe, I don't know. I haven't really put much thought into this by the way. <laughs> Oh, Pounce is a bug type move. I see. I think what I actually want to do is Terra Steel because I really want to knock out the Obama Snow before it can set up. Yeah, and I'm fine with them going for a Trick Room. Dude, that did nothing! And here's the Aurora Veil. That, that's what I didn't want to happen. And Trick Room comes out. I'm gonna kill the Obama so now let's start iron defensing up. Actually no, I wanna actually re reverse the trick room right now. Because we're gonna have Avalak in the back and we're most likely gonna go for chili reception. <coughs> so I wanna stop them from like switching and stuff. Get rid of Obama. He just goes for Psychic, interesting. So no switch. What's for item on my scissor? Assault vest. Ah, so I can change up moves. That's interesting. And I also can check the bird very well. But I don't think he brought the board, bird since he went for a trick room. Yeah, here's the Avalak, which I expected. Let's just go for a pounce into the slow king and let's Iron defense up. Dude, that did so much damage. I have no idea what Avalak tries to do. Yeah, that's not gonna do much more, man. I'm sorry. He goes for another trick room. I'm just gonna reverse it again, so why wouldn't I? And then I will win, hopefully. <sighs> oh yeah, let's start changing stuff. So Bronxong, I definitely think that should be fighting type. If fighting type doesn't work out, we can still change it later to something else. Um, this guy, normal, that's fine, I think. Azumarill, water, is good. 
Philippa may be better off as like flying or a defensive type like grass or ground. Okay, he actually removes my dude. That's crazy. I didn't think he would actually be able to remove my scissor. Okay, now I have to be really careful. I think my best play is to just remove a slow king. I think wool switch into body press might knock it out. Okay, he just went for goes for another helping hand. I don't think I will be able to knock it out, okay. Goes for now, rock slide doesn't do much luckily. Now I'm just gonna protect. So Aurora, actually Aurora Veil is gone. I think I'm fine with second my Pelipa and going for another iron defense. Yeah, Sloking goes down, Pelipa goes down. Because now Rain is up, I got my Thunder Guy in. I can already hear the ACDC music in the background. Oh, I hope this guy doesn't one-shot me, actually. Actually, we can trade. Because if we trade, I win. Yeah, if we don't trade, when I get damage on that, that's the Soul Twist. Okay. We already know he's not Sash. So I'm just gonna... Body press, kill the iron bundle. Get more chip on the Avalak. Yeah, Bronzong was goaded this format. I would probably think around running, uh, think about running leftovers on this guy. I think that's more consistent. And if not, I would definitely go for something like a Lumberry actually. Because um, then you will not be able to put, uh, be able to put, get put to sleep, which would be amazing, of course. Uh, however, I would first try leftovers, and then if you get taunted, just run um, mental herb. If you get spored, just run the anti spore item, the lumberry, or even safety goggles, because that will also allow you to, you know, know redirection. However, lumberry also will protect you from getting burned, so that's pretty good as well. Hmm. Now we, no. we fight a sun team with our rain team. Mm. Oh, that's a bit tough. Because uh, he got manual sun and that always beats rain. I think I want to lead Pelipper to get, try to get up Tailwind. And then I'm just going to have to live with the fact that sun is going to be up, I guess. Damn, this is really tough. I don't know. I don't know how to beat this, honestly. It's like, look, I can Tailwind, and I will also be able to go for, like, Volt Switch and stuff. Actually, yeah, I know what I do. I Volt Switch the Iron Morph, because then I will be able to hopefully kill it with Aqua Jet next turn. And I can switch up my Pelipper, and then I really want to remove the Sableye. And then if I have Torkoal in the back, they are forced out of the Torkoal. And then I hope that enough Pokemon survive, so that way my Pelipper can come back in. However, that's not the case since Torkel comes in and they go for fake out. Mm. So I think I just vote switch into Azumarill. And now I wanna switch this guy in. Yeah, I wanna I wanna switch this guy back in. And I think I'm gonna try to liquidate with Torkel. I'm banded, right? Oh, he protects. Does he burn me? Yeah, nothing I can do. No, I'm, I'm Citrus Berry without Belly Drum. That's fine. I think this should kill him now, and I'm gonna start play buffing the Sableye. Because I really wanna win the Weather War, like I said. Oh, they didn't kill. Who cares? I'm just gonna go with this guy. Because now he cannot damage me with his Torkoal. Oh, I missed play with. Well, I also can damage him from the looks of things. Uh, yeah, that's a bit unfortunate, isn't it? I think Hurricane does the most damage into Sableye. Switches into Gyarados. And he taunts, good play. Mm. 
think I wanna actually hard switch in my guy. And I wanna try to do more damage to the Sableye. Because um, with electric type attacks, I will be able to beat the Gyarados hopefully. And if he Dragon Dances, I think I'm still slower, but hey, what can I do? Terra's into an electric type and goes for Terra Blast, okay. Oh, luckily, Sableye hits himself. So now we know what his Terra is. I think I actually wanna save this guy. Uh, Arc for Jet Sableye switch him wrong zone. Because so I can start Iron Defensing up. Or going for Trick Room if I want to. As he protects, which is amazing. He still got for Torquil. However, yeah, now I got my um, now I got my Pelipper. I wanna Iron Defense and switch Pelipper in. Yeah, cause in the, in the rain he cannot do much damage. Bro, this game is stressful. It's taking super long, bro. Terror blasts me. Now the, the question is, do I wanna Tailwind? I think the answer is, yeah, let's try to Tailwind. Goes Iron Morph. Yeah, I die, of course. Get a big body press off. Now this should be in range of my Azumarill's Aqua Jet. Damn, I should have maybe Trick Wound. Ah, uh, he, he's smart for switching in Torquil. Yeah, I think I lose now. Actually, wait, isn't this guy faster than everyone? Actually, I think my this guy sh should be faster than everyone and kill everyone now. I don't know about killing Gyarados actually. Actually, wait, I got competitive, bro. Phantom is so big brain, bro. No, <laughs> no, bro, what's the word, bro? No, oh, I can't believe this. I can't believe this, bro. Imagine losing a game like this because you missed two players. <sighs> Dude, imagine how good Amoongus would be right here. I could literally just spoil everybody, bro. He led with a snail and the other snail. Isn't this guy four times weak to my scissor? I wish I had u turn right now. Bro, I can't believe that last game, bro. Dude, Phantom was so big brain. Oh god, luckily I'm a salt vest. Dude, Phantom was so big brain, bro, for that one. Ariyama comes out. I mean, I'm just gonna iron defense again. I think I wanna switch in my Pelipper. <coughs> bro, that's insane with that, that last game, bro. Yeah, he fakes out my guy. Flamethrower ain't gonna do shit. Now I'm gonna iron defense again. And hurricane the Hariyama, because we know he's not like super bulky assault rest. Let's change this guy out to Amogus. Amogus. Iron ball. Spore, clear smoke, protect, rage powder, Let's just give a max HP, no, no, not max, 290, let's think about, oh, I won, hit uh, yeah, GG, um, let's give him, like, do I want? Uh, I think I want him to be especially defensive. Plus four, knock him out, even if I sassy. Zero speed. Let's go, boys. Okay, Lilligan Torkel. Plus Parish Trap. Plus Scissor. Plus the Bird. Now, that's an interesting team. We have three of the same Pokemon. Then we have a Trick Room user. Well, I don't know. I think. Mm, unfortunately, I can't read back the Lilligant. Mm. 
Take one lead, like Azuma will scissor, when I have Pelipper and Rebecca as a switch in. And then Bronzo. Because, like, look at scissor, look at this team. If we ignore the Torkoal, scissor goes hard, you know? That's why I want to bring it. Unfortunately, I don't think we have anything to stop the Lilligan. However, we do have Bullet Punch on our, on our side, so... And also, we have Pounce. I don't, I don't think that's a good idea to use Pounce on a Lilligan. I don't know. You can already see this format. In this format, games are gonna take on forever, bro, because there are so much bulky switches and stuff without dynamics. Oh my god. Okay, that's really interesting. I think I just wanna double up that guy if it's possible. And I do think I wanna use my terror right here. Because I, I wanna stop this guy from doing whatever he wants to do. Most, most likely, he's gonna try to set up Tailwind. Oh, they did nothing, bro. Okay, just T-bolted. Man, I wish I would have killed it. But my calcs are so off. And that one-shot me. Bro, what the fuck? Yo, my calcs are so off. Unfortunately, calc deck still isn't working. I don't know if it ever will. Who cares? Bro, my calcs are so off, bro. It's insane if you ask me. Damn, it's crazy. This must be like Bandit Scissor or something like this. I don't know how to beat Vazuma right now. Either. Yo, that turn one did not go as I expected. Man. So Torkoal comes in. Dude, please let me. I'm gonna die, am I not? Okay. Man, if Scissor would have been gone, this game would have been 10 times easier. I literally have to double the torque and hope I kill it. Hey, I hit my hurricane, amazing. Should live this, yeah. There's still potential, there's still potential, don't get me wrong boys. Just gonna land another hurricane I think. And then I should be able to win maybe. Let's see, come on Pelipper bro. Yeah, I think I win. Jet is not killing my bronze zone. Play buff also isn't. We did it, boys. Dude, so far we only got one L in. The one where I missed play buff twice. Oh, I have seen this strategy. I have seen this. What I wanna do. No, I don't wanna set up Trick Room, actually, do I? Actually, I really wanna lead with competitive guy. Just in case he leads Arcanine. And I also wanna bring Among Us. And then in the back, I definitely wanna bring Rain. However, Bronzong looks amazing in this late game. I can still bring Pelipper, I'm gonna do it, I think. Of course, Pelipper hits so many of their things offensively for a lot of damage. However, I do think Chilling Water is just a horrible move. Fortunately, I think it's kind of the best option at the moment, if you look for water-type moves. Doesn't it get Hydro Pump anymore? Oh yeah, it does. Let's give it Hydro Pump. I go like this. I wanna try to spoil the Iron Hands. And I guess I'll try to get some damage off on the Hattery. Also, Brongzong resists most moves that he could go for into my bird, so I'm gonna switch this guy in. I do see Trickum coming out, however. I have the Iron Ball, so somebody is gonna die tonight, and also I'm gonna start Iron Defensing up. 
Because this guy cannot touch me because he lost access to mystical fire. Which is amazing for me and tough for me about it because look at their switches to spawn now. <coughs> <coughs> Looks tough, boy. Yeah, good night, my guy. Psyshock actually kills my Amoongus. Not even bad, boy. Not even bad. Let's go Pelipper. Now we can Hurricane the Iron Hands and we can reverse the Trick Room. Hey, he got the same avatar as me, that's funny. <sighs> dude, I think, like, imagine, dude, I don't know how bulky his Iron Hands is, bro, but I could see myself not doing 50% to it. Oh no, he woke up! Wait, that's tough. That's super tough, actually. Is this guy alive? Oh, no, covered cloak. I mean, I could easily kill the Iron Hands right here, however, I much rather double the Hatterene right now. I hope my final just kills. Because then body press might just remove the iron hands. I don't think it will, but like. I need to take one hit from iron hands in this game still. And my bird looks really good, especially if I have Arcanine. Yeah, I didn't kill. Ice punch, don't freeze me. Okay, I think I win actually. Because now this guy gets hurricaned. Oh, wait, he got slacking in the back door. Let's protect him. Let's double protect when, because obviously he doesn't he doesn't have a graphire in. There's no point in not double protecting, so. Yeah, facade. Nice punch. Now Hurricane. And I will double up the Iron Hands in case he survives Hurricane. Which he may, you never know, with this kind of bulk, bro. My head are super off right now. Yeah, he cannot move. Hurricane quits, okay. Slacking goes down too. Yeah, Arcanine comes in, gives me my boost. Gives me my boost. That's game. This one is fire, bro. What does the leather look like? Yo, what the fuck? 1572? How do people how do people already play so much? But the leather is already at 15. Bro, I, I noticed that you are able to play like battle stadium doubles. I think I noticed that today, <laughs> like a few hours ago. <coughs> People are already like in the 1500s, which is insane if you ask me. Mm. I think I wanna lead with these two, because if he doesn't lead Arcanine, Scissor clicks Bullet Punch into like most of his team. And if he leads Arcanine, I get the Defiant Boost. In the back, I definitely. I'm really thinking about bringing Amoongus because Spore looks so good into a steam. However, I think Bronxong looks really good and Pelipper does as well. So I'm gonna bring these two instead. Yeah, here's my Defiant boost. I am just going to immediately Thunder the Arcanine and switch in my Pelipper. Because I will get a Brain, so I cannot miss. And also, if a Dragonite Dragon dances, I can go for Tailwind with my Pelipper. Pelipper is Sash, okay. Uh, very good. Very well done, Phantom. He switches us to Chim Pao, who I think dies. Chim Pao. Uh, what? He tries Bandit, he speeded me. Bro. Wait, I I'm gonna terror. Oh no, I can't terror anymore. Bro, I did not think that would kill me. Yeah, GG. Bro, what the hell? Ghost Gastelon. 
East Priest by Pelipper. Hey, that's actually fine, I think. Actually, it's not, but like. Bro, he must be adamant as well. It's gonna be multi scale too. I don't wanna switch out my bronzong. I think I made the correct decision letting this guy go to sleep. Dude, Dragon Knight's gonna kill me with the next one, bro. That's so insane. Yeah, that's super insane. I need my my bronzong to kill the rest of his team. Right here, Lumberry would have been absolutely amazing. I think I'm gonna make Bronzong Lumberry. I think that's the best set, the best item on Bronzong. Because if I were, uh, what's it called? If I were Lumberry, I would have won immediately. Now I need to, my Bronzong to wake up. Wake up, Bronzong. I believe in you, bro. I think at this point, even uh, I, I, at this point, I need to get uh, what's it called? Another boost because I think the champ power is just gonna kill me. Oh, don't feel. Oh, he can't freeze me. Actually, I think I might wanna go for trip. No, no, no. I have to body press. Who is faster? Gaston is faster. Yeah, no, I have to trick him then. I'm drowsy now. We know this guy got protect. We don't know if Gastelon has protect, so I'm gonna body press the Gastelon. Okay. Okay, no protect. He survived. Please burn me. Oh, oh freeze me. Yes, please freeze me. Oh. Uh, now we switched off the Dragon Knight as well, so you can e-speed me again. Bro, like this is so crazy. I haven't touched the game or like watched any videos just for the, like, I think it was just like three days or whatever, you know? Let's actually see. Yeah, for three days and all of a sudden, so much shit is happening, bro. It's insane. And the game is over. I guess he quit me. Yo, that's insane, boy. That's absolutely insane. Let's actually just go Pelipper Azumarill this time. No. What happened last time was I didn't kill it when he killed me. Let's maybe go with these two and then Pelipper in the back. And then Azumarill. Amorgus would look really good as well, but like, I don't know. Really want a terror and just thunder. Go for terror. I can't switch and I don't have u turn, so there's not really anything I can do. However, with a covered cloak, I am gonna be immune to their fake out, which is amazing. If I even go for. Actually, I wanna double up the go for terror. I don't know if I even have fake out. Or even. Like, maybe they just hypnosis me out. Good play, good play. However, what does their switch in? I could Volt switch. I don't want to. My sister with her assault vest took that really well as well. Hmm. Come on, bro. Do something. Like he knows he's gonna lose his cover right here. Like he's not gonna do much damage with his bird, so he's thinking about switching, but like he doesn't have a switch in, you know. He just needs to leave in Goffet Hill. He decided to switch, he's gonna I think he's gonna die. Yeah, he died. And now I actually wanna double up. 
uh, his bird. Bullet punch and wolf switch. Actually, I don't think I wanna wolf switch. Right, that's fine. That's happened now. Cause actually, wolf switch kills. If I'm if I win the speed tie, that would be nice. However, I don't. So I wolf switch. So now I'm gonna be able to bring out my Azumarill. And now, if my last one sh is gonna be Torque, yep, I can switch my Pelipper right now. Uh, switch, switch in my Pelipper. Oh, I'm trapped. I forgot. However, that should still be fine. At this point, I only need my Scissor to like weaken the Goffertail, and I'm gonna protect my Azumarill to see what Goffertail is gonna go for. If it's Trick Room, I'm kind of screwed. Yeah. However, that's fine. Cause Pelipper. Gonna get the sun up and there's nothing you can do about it. Aqua Jet should kill the Goffertail and then Pump should kill the Torkoal. So this should be game. Yeah, goodbye. And I actually hit my Hydro Pump, which is amazing. Good luck to you. Bro, this meta is so crazy. Like, you don't play for three days and all of a sudden, everything changed, bro. Everything is different. Like you don't know anything anymore, bro. Like I have been following this game weeks be since weeks before release. I have been coming up with sets and like figuring out what other people run and shit like this. I've been doing since before the game came out. And then I stopped doing it for like three days, and all of a sudden everything's different, bro. Everything's different. Insane, if you ask me. Yo, I got the Lumberry Bronzong in this game, which is gonna be absolutely amazing. I don't have something to drink anymore, though. Looks like this will be the end of my video <laughs> pretty soon. <laughs> <coughs> uh -huh, uh -huh. I'm still gonna do like some uni stuff, but I'm almost done, so I just gotta do like a fine tuning. Cause like, oh bro, it looks so bad right now. It looks like so bad. Look at this shit, bro. Imagine I send this to my group and I'm like, oh yeah, this is so good, boys. Oh yeah, look at this. Oh yeah, mm. look. I just copied the one where it said where it like, uh, where good, like, yeah. Uh, can't show this to my group like that, bro. I gotta make it look good and also do a lot of other stuff as well. Who cares? <laughs> That's really interesting. I mean, Hurricane should just remove the Amogus. If I miss, I mean, I miss, I guess. I still got my Lumberry Bronzong and also my Hurricane Pelipper. Oh, I should have terrored. I'm so stupid, bro. Oh, actually, that's fine. I can terror now. Now he's gonna expect me to terror even less. Torquil comes in. Yeah, I'm gonna terror body press the King Gambit. I had to see, I had to kill a King Gambit like this, but what can I do, eh? And I'm gonna switch in my Pelipper, of course. By the way, fun fact, guys. The reason I'm playing my Pelipper so well is because I used to be on the receiving end so many times. You guys probably saw my videos how I love to use, like, Torkoal and stuff. And every time when I use, like, Torkoal against Pelipper and the opponents actually knew what they were doing, they would... Um, make it so the first Pokemon to die is on the opponent's team. So in this case, Amoongus died first. And then I was forced into Torquil because obviously I have to go out to someone. And then that basically meant that um, Torquil needed to come in and then Pelipper was able to come in afterwards. Which obviously, um, yeah, it works out pretty well, I got to say. But this is why you always want to try lots of different stuff and always learn from your losses. Like, I always review when I lose, like, why did, did I lose? You know, like, why? Why did I lose? And then it helps me figure out, like, what happens, you know? Like, in this one, for example, like, I won, you know? Why did, why did I win? Because I lost a lot. <laughs> so, yeah, I hope that's a lesson that you can uh, take home. And tell your parents about how you learned that valuable lesson. And yeah, see you in the next time of uh, 
Sesamstraße, I guess. Bad with Pokémon, hau da rein. Ciao. Wait, fuck.